Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all ages, welcome back to the Bro Show. I am Justin, and today, you already know, Money Bank is right around that corner, uh, cor the corner, and I am super excited for it. So that's why I decided to do a Money Bank pre-match for 2023. So, we're going to find out, maybe I might be right, maybe the winner of this Money Bank will win the 2023 Money Bank ladder match, maybe, let me know in the comments below. Who do you think is going to win? The men's money event live match. I might. Uh, let me think. I don't know. Um, but guys, before we continue on with this video, make sure to like the video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. We're trying to reach 500 subscribers by July 13th. So let's see if we can hit it this summer. I'm really psyched if we can hit 500 subscribers because that's one of the milestones. So yeah, yeah, let's see if we can do it. So the so the participants in the 2023 Men's Money Bank Ladder Match are Damian Priest, L.A. Knight, Ricochet. Actually, hold on. Let me go Damian Priest real quick. Cause, all right. Actually, no. We're going to watch. I decided to watch. So we have L.A. Knight. You know, we have to get Damian Priest in it. I am... Yeah, I, I kind of wish somebody else would have made... I kind of wish... Um, real mate... Nah, I guess Priest is the right pick. Uh, Ricochet, obviously he qualified. You can't have a ladder match without at least one high flyer in there. It just wouldn't make sense without having Ricochet in there. Somebody who can jump off a ladder onto something else would be absolutely awesome. We also got Butch of the Brawling Brutes. 50-50 on how that's going. 50-50 on that one. And we also... Let's see. Dang. Shinsuke also qualified. Uh, I'm I'm alright with that. That's high. Right. And the final participant was gosh. Dang it. Um, I don't, wait, I think it's coming back to me. Oh, if you saw Harley Race when I was going down, the the WWE 2K23 NXT Race to NXT pack has come out. Came out yesterday. I'm absolutely psyched. You know, I, I feel like this one was a pretty decent one. Uh, I feel like there could have been, I don't know, some little more people. Uh, you know, different NXT superstars, but it's all right. Uh, we're also getting Santos Escobar in the match. Had to Google it. Oh my gosh, it really just. Gosh darn it. Now I guess. Go all the way down. All the way back down. Alright, here we go. So put the money in the bank on the line. Let's see. Who do you guys think is going to win this? Oh, not championship. Uh, I think Priest, maybe Shinsuke, I don't know. Whoever's cashing in. Oh, man. Uh, I'll be shocked to see who cash in. I think Priest is going to win it. Priest or LA. Maybe Shinsuke. And out of those people, er, I can tell y'all this. Most, everybody in this Money Bay ladder match is not about to cash in on Roman Reigns. I can tell y'all that now. If somebody's catching it, it's going to be on Seth Rollins, sadly. Or it's going to either be on Rollins, Gunter, Theory, and that's it. Nobody's going to cash in on Roman. Sorry, sorry, but nobody's going to do it. I bet y'all. Uh, I, I, I bet a million dollars no one cashes, thinks about cashing in on Roman Reigns. It's, it just doesn't make sense. But this man WWE might Universe cash in on to Seth Rollins. I mean, LA yeah. Do the talking tonight. The following the is has some the money change. in the big ladder match. To win this match, the winner is a superstar who climbs up the ladder and retrieves a briefcase with a contract inside of it to be cashed in over the next year, anytime, any place. Making his way to the ring from Hagerstown, Maryland, weighing in at 230 pounds. L himself all right the megastar la night i kind of wish xavier woods would have won that race. match between la and xavier woods but it's all right it was all right. wait no montez lost my bad no but LA, la he cheated but it's all right you know what that's why he's not winning this thing my money's on damian priest <laughs> This year, Damian Priest might win it, or maybe Ricochet. You never know. He might cash in on 
Gunter to get that IC Danny title back. I, I feel like he deserves another the shot at the IC WWE title. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. The judgment day. You think he deserves another shot at it or no? New York. I think so. Weighing in at 249 pounds, Damian Priest. Priest Let's has go and we will his deepest, darkest be doing the women's money to bank. I think We've all the participants in the rest right? of Judgment One, Day two, three, destroy families, six people, five, put competitors six in the hospital. I think we're still missing one person. Yeah. For Priest, the ends justify the means. Um, I'll have to check that out just to be sure because, what, six people in it? Yeah, so I'll Google it and then a look of pure we'll do another episode of the Women's Freedom Bank. I think oh, Priest might win. On the oh my WWE gosh, Universe. and I didn't really. Hell, dang. I forgot to get the thumbnails. See, that's, I always forget. I'm always so excited to do the videos for you guys that I forget the dang thumbnail. Shame, shame, shame. But uh, yeah, let's get it going. I'm ready for it. So yeah, who do you, let me know in the comments, type down, type down in the comments below, who do you think is going to win the 2023 Men's Money in the Bank? We're about to see an air show. I want Ricochet to get that IC title back, or take it from Theory, history. take the US title from Theory. But is it Ricochet drafted to Raw, right? Right? Is it Ricochet drafted to Raw? I don't know. And from Purdue, Kentucky. Weighing in at 190 pounds, Ricochet! I think so. Ricochet, one of the great high flyers in WWE today. Okay, Corey, I, I, how I do you think compare Ricochet, Ricochet to, to the high flyers of the past? You can name some of the all-time greats in Rey Mysterio, Shawn Michaels, so that's superstars impressive. who truly excelled in the sky, but not to the yeah, level that. that Ricochet has. <laughs> Stretch every day. <laughs> I just love to sit back, relax, <laughs> and enjoy the show oh, man. because yeah, maybe Ricochet is going to do something special. Do some squats, push-ups. Pull-ups, I could do that, right? Yeah, just uh, without breaking my back in two, just uh, be out laying on the ground. The bruiser of the brawling brutes, and representing the brawling brutes from Birmingham, England, I can't really butch in at two hundred and five pounds. I feel like an all-star okay, money to bank this year. Exactly what you're getting with this guy should have been Priest. That's a very different competitor than he was in NXT. That's for sure. Uh, but fun to watch. Priest, Ricochet, Woods, or LA. So uh, I'll take LA in it. Um, maybe Bronson Reed no, in the not. money to bank ladder match. We could also get Solo. You know, you know, just to put in that little bit of sizzle. Like, could Solo win and cash in on Roman? Who wants to see that? Let me know in the comments below. Who wants to see Solo win, maybe like the 2024 right, Money in the right. Bank okay, and cash in on Roman? Okay, he's not quite all there. we all know yeah, Roman's going to be champion. Yeah, but that's what makes him so dangerous. Okay, we all know it. I have no doubt in my mind that Roman Reigns will be champion 2024. So what did he be champion for? What? Four years, right? The King of Strong Style. Three years. Oh, 2019. 2020. Yeah, get ready. 20, We're about to see the brutal striking ability so, of Shinsuke if, you know, Nakamura. I'm losing it. Or I'm gonna be champion for five dang years. Shin is a true international Let me say, superstar. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna Google this. And from Kyoto, Japan. Weighing in at 220 pounds, Shinsuke Nakamura! Guys, Shin is as expressive as he is dangerous. Here's what I love about Shinsuke Nakamura. He's got his own style, and he's always going with his own flow. Nakamura is brash and fearless inside the ring. And he looks damn cool doing it. Let's 
Is it because of what? Ape? No, he went out what? Because he beat the Fiend and Strowman at Payback. A Lucha oh, Libre yeah, Megastar yeah, now like looking to dominate WWE. I'd say there's a very good chance he'll so do that. Yeah, because Payback and in 2019. Representing Legato del Fantasma from Mexico City, Mexico, yeah. weighing in at 200 pounds. Yeah, it's 29 pounds. Escobar! So the men have been champ for four, four years, five Pay years. Pay respect to the five, four years. of the streets. Yeah, Santos Escobar does not play games. Escobar is calm, steady, calculated, and Four does years. whatever year he has years to Reigns do to succeed. Five years as champion. That's why he deserves the new title. It's five dang years. Wow. This superstar possesses the <laughs> smoothest He's got to lose that title sometime, in right? the business. It hits you like an arrow. Going for a five years, ten year champion. And he also possesses if that a happens, driver that will absolutely flatten I'm you. And it is power I'm with bad intentions. If he's been champ for ten years. Because he's always going to win. And let's all remember what is all in the briefcase hanging above the ring. If you win, you can cash in that contract at any point in time. So now someone's going to cash in the opportunity. Only maybe on the next episode. Or on the next episode, I'll be trying to teach you all. I'm trying to teach you tomorrow on how to cash in a money, a money to make contract. In play mode, I don't really know how much so, but I feel like. Uh, I feel like I have a good look on it. It's a good look on it. It's a good I think it's all in the AI. It's to be interrupted during your climb because you refuse to lay in some extra offense before me. Because I know you are back and you have to have the chance to mid cash in. I can go out and get the turn on. Mid match run in. There's a whole bunch of stuff. I'll do this in the next I'm not going to play all this in one match. But guys, if you guys are doing favors, do watch the video. If you're still watching, make sure to drop a like and subscribe. And try to get 500 subscribers by July 13th. Which is next month, a little under a month. I think we might make it, maybe. I don't know. I need to help by helping us reach by subscribing. Can you guys help out by subscribing to the channel? Because we are at level 300 something subscribers. I don't think we're at 200. And now getting a ladder in place. We are at. Don't sleep on how dangerous a spot that is for a lot of people. Lots of potential for injury here at ringside. These superstars better be careful. Yeah, 355. So, that means we need another 145 subscribers within the next. Uh, let's just say within the next. Over the next 27, 28 days. 27 days. So that would be we would need five subscribers a day for the next 30 and for the next 28 days. He's ejected from the ring. Into the ring now. Yeah, right. Turn around Ricochet's attack. Brutal. Pretty short. This is no stranger to running people up. Five times ten is fifty. Gotta find a way to get out of this. Just be short. So 29 days. Guys, that's what we need. So we need we got 29 days. Let's oh that's wow that's crazy. So we have 28 days. So that's what six a day? 
Nice. He's in his He'll take things into the six ring. Six at 28. Oh, yeah. So we need six subscribers a day for the next 28 days. If we want to just beat that dude, day. That's a lot of subscribers in six a day, next 28 days. I think y'all can do it. If y'all just watch the end, just subscribe, or just do this. Just go to the channel and just subscribe, and then you, can, you don't even have to watch it. You know? All you have to do is just subscribe to the channel. You know, and then you can go on and watch your day. Just take a couple seconds out of your day. Just a couple minutes and just share with like five people go and hope you just have five people start to go. So six a day for the next 28 days and we will reach that 500 subscribers. Because that's what our goal is, 500 subs. And then we're trying to reach a thousand subs. But that's after we hit 500. I think we can do that. I think we can do that. You guys just subscribe every day. Every day, new subscriber, and we would definitely reach five to ten subscribers a day for the next 28 days. No, six to eight, six to ten subscribers a day for the next 28 days, and we would have five more subscribers. But they, if we get ten people, ten subscribers a day for the next what? That's 280 subscribers in the next 28 days. Subscribers in a month. That would be absolutely awesome. So if you guys can help us out, just like I said, six to ten a day for the next month. But why is there money in the bank briefcase look like that? Like, why is it people are not grabbing it? It's always ten to ten. And it straightens out, straightens out when the other person when somebody tries to grab it. No, priest. Oh my. I thought they were about to go over. Oh, LA Knight. Is he going to win? Yeah. Maybe. Oh, oh, LA. LA. Oh, no. And Priest going right back up. Can we see Priest cash in the Arena Bank this year? Maybe we can beat him. Uh, beat Derrick for time. Oh, man. This is crazy. Let's see. Who hasn't climbed up the ladder yet? Now look at the money bank contract. That's they need to fix that. Y'all let me y'all comment down below do they need to fix that. Look at that. That's just hanging two inches in the air. That happened in a match off the air. Now we should have fun. I did this match no I think I did this. I did this off air just for fun to see you win. And Yes, Priest won um, off the chip off air. But the money in bank briefcase literally did that. And you couldn't grab it. You had to set up a ladder. And press L1. So you grab nothing but thin air and had to play the money ring. And you had to then the, the then the briefcase would go all the way back up. So they need to fix that, because that's not right. Ooh, nasty kick. Maybe that's just happening in my game. It's just happening in your living game. Oh, I think Butch is bleeding. Yeah. I think he's bleeding. I think he's not. He wasn't thin. He is now. Oh, Butch. Oh, I think that's bad. This guy's going to be LA. Oh, that's a good one. Priest, grab the ladder. What are you doing? Oh, my gosh. Yep. Wrapped up. He's back to the ring. Oh, he was about to. And Escobar didn't see that coming. There they go. Oh, 
Those can be dangerous, oh, guys. No, no, I don't. Without a doubt. Ricochet, move. Move. On the top. Oh, oh, this is the one. Oh, my God. <laughs> Ricochet about to miss the money in the bank. Oh, Dang, come on, Ricochet. Take the capability to stand. Escapes in a nick of time. Somebody's got a barricade. Hurry, kill him. Oh, he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Somebody's got a kendo stick. Oh, Santos. Santos is about to win. Now, watch this. Watch this. Santos makes it. Watch when he comes back. Santos Escobar, Mr. Money in the Bank. <laughs> Can you imagine that? Actually, that'd be crazy. When a ladder is involved, you know that, it's going to be good. Uh, that was, but this one that was, was better uh, than good. It was incredible. I would like to see. I would, I would like to see somebody go through the ladder. But you know what? I'm not gonna lie. Santos, Mr. Money in the Bank. Baby. Here is your winner and Mr. Money in the Bank. Santos Escobar. After an intense and jaw-dropping match, here is the wow, latest Money Santos. in the Bank winner. The action we just witnessed was really was something good. else. This is one I won't forget for a long time. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. Absolutely awesome. Well, what do you guys think of that? Santos, Mr. Money in the Bank. Yes, no, maybe so. I don't... Uh, Money Bank this year. Cash in on Theory or Gunzer. Don't cash in on World Champion because it'll just be a waste of a Money Bank contract opportunity. So definitely cash in on Theory or Gun Theory or Gunzer. You'll have a he'll have a slight chance. Don't cash in on Roman or Seth. You got no chance, bro. Well, thank you guys for watching this episode of the Pro Show. I hopefully hopefully you enjoyed it because I did. Uh, show your love for, for the channel by liking and subscribing. Like I said, we're trying to hit 500 subscribers, and we're gonna probably need six six subscribers a day for the next 28 days. Let's see if we can do it. Ten a day for the next 28 days. You guys would just be awesome. Okay, you'd be awesome. Okay, and maybe how about this? If we hit 500 subscribers by July 13th. I will live stream a whole, I don't know, you know how it is, if you guys, if we get that 500 subscriber mark, whoever is the 500 subscriber, if it shows up this time, will get their own shout out, and, now that's all I got. That's all I got for now. Uh, but yeah, 500 subscribers will get their own personal shout out on the show. And, uh, yeah. So let's see if we can hit it. Try to be that 500 subscriber. And that's all I have. I, I, if I think of something better, I'll let you guys know. But uh, that's all I got for now. Thank you guys for watching. You guys are awesome fans. And I love you guys for watching the bro show. And help, like I said, 500 subscribers, so close. I think y'all can do it. Smash that subscribe button, smash that like button, and definitely turn on all notifications so you don't miss a video. See you guys in the next one. Peace.